Welcome back to uh, Paragon Performance. Uh, today we are going to show you how to put a crimp collar on a PTFE stainless steel braided hose. Uh, this is the majority of the hose that we use at our shop. Um, we prefer it over other types of hose. So first, Austin's going to show you um, the two sides of a PTFE hose when you cut it. There's always uh, one side that is a little easier to install which would be um, this side right Yep. Yeah. and the other side when you cut it it tends to flare out we call that um, like flowering fl flowering side blossoming blossoming side so what we're going to do is show you two things we're going to show you how to use a collaring tool which is this uh, step collaring tool and if you can see inside there it's got different steps that um, fit different collars so that one fits between dash 3 and dash 16 collars and then we have the split dies, which um, if you put them the other way too, Austin, show them, it, it helps guide the hose into the collar. So it keeps all the braid pushed in the right way. So Austin's going to show you this way first. And this is with our Dash 6 hose and Dash 6 brass collars. We'll take the bad side and put that in first. Make it easier on yourself. And see how quickly that goes in there. Take the needle nose and push it on. Uh, now he's going to show you, um, they do so many hoses here that this, this other way almost slows them down sometimes. So they've gotten pretty quick at just using needle nose pliers to install the collars. There it goes, slips right on. All right, and this also helps to start rounding out the hose to get it ready to receive the fitting. But we'll have more of that to come. Thanks a lot.